the UTEP Centennial weekend celebration will continue through the weekend. And I'm here right now with Big Daddy D, David Latine. And first off, uh, you come back to El Paso quite often, but how long since you've been back into town? It seems like about five or six months I was here before. And so I, I get here as often as I can. I try to make it at least two or three times a year. To be a part of this, though, the Centennial Celebration, which was voted by the fans, and seeing all these great uh, former athletes, that has to be a thrill for you. Oh, absolutely. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's rewarding for me to be able to be in the same room with some of these players. I mean, there's some great athletes here, and it's, uh, it's just joyful to be back in El Paso to be with them. Now, you wrote a book. We had the opportunity to talk to you the last time a few years back when that book was published. Give our, uh, our listeners and our fans out there a little idea of what you've been doing uh, since the book came out. Well, I own a pharmacy, and uh, I'm quite busy doing that. And uh, David Latine Sports and uh, Nutrition for Youth is coming up as well. It's a nonprofit. I'm working on that. And so I've uh, just been quite busy with those things. We are coming up on the 50th anniversary of this national championship team. Is it hard to believe as the years go by that we're now uh, approaching 50 years for this team? Hard to believe I'm still around. <laughs> I'm so thankful. I wake up every morning, I, I pinch myself, and I, I'm still here. But it, it is very difficult to believe it's been so long, and uh, so many things have happened in Texas since then. The one thing that haven't happened is that another championship from the, from Texas. So we're still the only ones. That's, uh, I don't know if that's good or bad, but it is what it is. Well, I'll tell you this much, Big Daddy. Knowing that Tim Floyd has the kind of team he's assembled this year, there's a lot of talk that this UTEP team will go back to the NCAA tournament and have a chance to do some special things. I'm sure as a former minor, that's something you're pretty excited about. I am so excited about that. I, I think about it all the time, and I was just li riding, in from the, riding in from the airport today. We were talking about uh, we've got great guards. They had big, big players the last couple of years with no point guards. I heard they had three or four now, and that's, that's exciting. So I'm, I'm excited for them. I think the best part about having you back here is that no matter how often you come back, just the reaction, the response you get from the crowd has got to be unbelievable. This is something they'll never forget no matter how many years go by. Well, you're right. So when you win, <laughs> it's difficult to forget about that. Yeah, and uh, some, of the, some of the people actually are still here. That would, there were our fans then as well. So it, it's great, great to be back to see that. Great to see you. Enjoy the festivities this weekend, and thanks for joining us. Thanks, Steve. Thanks for having me. Big D, David Latine with us as the centennial celebration continues here at UTEP.